Hey guys, how's it going? So, today we got ourselves a church. And uh, I don't know if it's opened. And we, well, I drive by every day for work type thing. Almost every day. And I'm coming out this way. Just never filmed it yet. Or even taking a look at it. So, thought we would take a look today. Let's go to the house first. Hopefully some of these doors are open. I can see right now there's a padlock there, so. Padlock. So maybe you're on back. So, I haven't been putting videos up for for a bit, and reason is we're getting a whole lot of rain. So that kind of kills any chance. It's an outhouse. Any chance for me to go exploring? Because once. You, you're getting a whole lot of rain in this area. <laughs> you know, you deal with mosquitoes and wet grass and plus my workload has real has been out of town a lot. So I haven't had a lot of time to. Oh, it's locked. But as you can see Maybe we could look in some of these. Whoa! Rooms. I don't know if you could see much in there. Looks like somebody really cares about this place. Try the church. Oh, I really want to go in there. Sucks. Tell it was used at least in the 1970s. It got the upgrades. We got the next best thing though. Let's 
check out some of these graves. This one's 2009. Oh, there's Ukrainian again. It's a lot of the theme around here. Got a couple unmarked ones. It's unusual. Ninety two thousand must be getting to some of these older ones. Sixty six. Oh, I really like checking these places out like this because this is a lot of history that people don't realize who live around here. And these were the generations that lived out here in the 30s and 40s when there was no power or the way that we are we live today you know they made it possible for for their future generations to have a nice life it's a uh, 67 65 61 2 It is nice though that people do care enough 
and take care of this. It's just, just imagine some of these provinces in Canada or even, you know, states in the United States that don't even do this. They just kind of forget about them. I think that's 1975 and that's 18 looks like an 8 so 88 Somebody spent some money to get that one restored. A couple more that are unmarked. Is that a C or an F? McFallister? That's a 79. I think these ones are really cool. Ones that are in Ukrainian. My uh, part of my family is traditionally from, well, my mother's side is from the Ukraine. And then about 1800s, my great 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 grandfather. Move to Canada. That's probably a mushroom. So that's uh, another explorer in the books, and uh, I think it was really cool. I really wanted to get in there, get into the uh, church there, and the house, but you can't win them all. And what was really cool in one of my other videos when it came, I think it was a Frieden Stahl one, that somebody from Germany was able to find a, a link to Canada from through one of my videos, which is really, really cool. And uh, it actually made my day, to be honest. So, yeah, I'll see you on the next one.